Hey friends, VLCD1. I am down 1.6 from my load and um, happy about that. I, God, I rattled on yesterday, so I'm gonna try and make this as quick as possible. So all about the load. I did a three day load. I talked about why I did three days yesterday. I don't normally do three days, I normally do two. Um, I push for clean loads, high fat, low carbs, no sugar, no alcohol. Um, I, you know, I really watch my potatoes and my crackers and my bread and all of that and just try and get that protein and that fat in there. And so that's what I did yesterday. And um, so let's see real quick, scrambled fresh eggs, a uh, couple eggs. I don't ask me about measurements because I can never keep track of all that crap. I've just been doing this for too long. I kind of gauge it. So a um, couple fresh eggs, good sized dollop of heavy whipping cream. Um, I heated the pan and threw in a couple tablespoons of Kerrygold butter. Um, I fried up a couple pieces of bacon in that and uh, added my eggs along with the whipping cream and the bacon and some cheese, cheddar cheese, and is that it? I don't think I ate avocado or sour cream or anything. I ate that. Um, I had bulletproof coffee in the morning, which I will not be doing on this particular round. Um, it's funny, I went back and looked at old vlogs and, and my bulletproof coffee video vlog, the last one, 1 1.5, thousand views or something it's like really people people don't normally um, have that much of an interest in HCG unless it's a before and after video because I have that one that's hundred thousand views wait it's like 116,000 or whatever um, but this was a 1,500 views on bulletproof coffee while you're on too. And I, I know that half those, more than half those people weren't interested in HCG. They're probably just interested in Bulletproof Coffee. So anyways, no Bulletproof Coffee in P2, but I did do that yesterday. See, I'm already rambling. Um, my scramble, I did a couple shots of cod liver oil. I did random handfuls of macadamia nuts throughout the day for lunch. What did I do for lunch? Did I eat lunch? Oh, yeah, I had chipino. I just did a, it's a seafood stew. I did chipino. Kind of made me feel a little sick. Um, just because by that point I'd had my fair share of macadamia nuts. And then I had... Tri-tip. I did tri-tip with the padrone peppers. Had been sautéed in olive oil and salt and pepper. And the, um, added those. I just... Stood up and ate my meal which is so wrong you should definitely always sit down um, and eat especially in P2 but I was in a hurry trying to get the last tidbits of what needed to be shoved in in my calculated load uh, before I went to bed and then another handful of macadamia nuts oh I know what I had I had a, a heavy whipping cream strawberry frozen strawberry shake with stevia added that's it so um, instead of doing I don't do ice cream or any of the desserts or anything because I end up with a hellacious headache um, when I begin P2 if I do too many desserts with sugar so I did have a little chunk of chocolate and by then I just I, I just wanted to keep everything down um, because I did you know that was the whole reason for having to go and do a this third day on on loading so down 1.6 to begin um, happy to see a bunch of people said hello yesterday I wish I could name you all in person but I can't because I already have HCG brain and I'm driving um, and I can't see my mirror so I don't know what's behind me um, I feel good I didn't sleep worth a damn I get, I, I was like, I was listening to Ricky this morning. She's like, I, I get anxious and I get a little jacked up and I can't sleep and I don't really feel that well when I load. And I'm like, oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> so um, I didn't sleep very well and I never really do all through HCG. 
actually any diet I've ever done. I can sleep really well. Um, I am posting on Instagram every day. I may not be able to vlog every day because I'm just such a spaz and um, I do know that vlogging would help me, but I'm totally addicted to Instagram. So I have like three different accounts. One of them is an HCG account and I um, tend to post something there every single day because I like it. It's artsy fartsy and all that. So today, let's see, it's 1.12. I have had a Americano Italian coffee with nothing in it. I am still sipping on a Cali Kicker, which is cayenne, um, water, lemon, and a little stevia, a little cinnamon. Um, and I haven't had any food yet and I, I feel fine. I just go with it. I don't, I don't freak out about, oh my God, it's noon. I got to eat. I haven't eaten. I'll, I'll probably have an apple in an hour or so. I have to go make lunch for my patient. Um, but I, I feel fine and I'm not hungry and I'm not thinking about food. So I'm, I'm not going to eat because that's just, to me, that's important to just listen to your body. And I know that I loaded well enough yesterday that I, I just don't need to eat. So I'll probably eat later today. I'll probably have an apple. Um, I have some chicken broth that's homemade. And I'll probably add some zucchini noodles. And if I if I do get hungry, I have salad planned. I made my dressing, a homemade dressing um, with MCT oil, balsamic vinegar. Yes, I know balsamic vinegar is not on protocol because it does have a slight amount of sugar in it. But I've always used it. Um, and I used a good seasonings packet for just Italian, Italian dressing. So, um, water, balsamic vinegar, MCT oil. If you don't know about MCT oil, you need to find out about MCT oil while you're in P2. It's expensive, but it is the one thing that gets me through my rounds because I use it. I use it when I don't use coconut oil. If I don't want to taste the coconut and if it's a oil that I'm using in a dressing, I always use MCT oil. So, all right, I'm keeping it under 10 because um, it took forever. I, I'm so unfamiliar now with YouTube. I don't know why it took hours and hours to load that vlog yesterday. I mean, yeah, it was 15 minutes, but it shouldn't have taken that long. So, um, happy releases to everybody that's on around. I'm so thrilled to be here and involved uh, again with this community because yeah, as much as I love Instagram, um, you don't get that, you get the written comment and feedback, but you don't get that face to face like, oh, I feel like shit today. Oh, I feel great today. Oh, I'm so excited about losing. You know, I mean, I just, I get to know all of you. I laugh out loud at some of you watching you, you know, just be like, yeah, I lost 10 pounds this week. <laughs> so happy releases, everybody. Love all of you. Take care. Ciao.